We are at the new Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith is with me, the former England international, of course. The match has so much potential, and kickoff is just moments away. It's Tottenham Hotspur against Newcastle United. I think the first ten minutes might tell us how this match is going to pan out, who can gain the upper hand, who can get hold of this ball and ask all the questions. He's beaten his man. Got to clear it now. This is today's Tottenham Hotspur team. Hugo Lloris starts in goal. Tongi Undombele plays with Musa Sissoko in midfield. And they're going to go with one striker up front. Newcastle United's lineup. Martin Dubravka is the goalkeeper. Nabil Ben Taleb starts with John Joe Shelby in the centre of the park. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. Stopping the pass getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Found good room out here. Here's Joe Linton. He's cut it out. Lucas. This does look promising. Made a quick interception. Could be a quick break here for Newcastle. It's there to be attacked at the back post. Good work by the goalkeeper. Lucas. Nothing wrong with the industry of the team. That little bit of inspiration lacking, but they need to get the excellent vision. Son! Oria. Now Sissoko. Son. Well, that stopped him in his tracks because he's given offside. There was plenty of space in behind to run into as well. Rose. Here's Bentaleb. Joe Linton. Well, it's a pleasure to be in this new stadium. Great initiative by Tottenham Hotspur, Alan. Yes, it does make for... Surely! Not really tested the goalkeeper, but sometimes it can look a bit too easy. He made sure he made the save confidently. Yeah, he did, and he doesn't make too many mistakes, this lad. It's good play to uh, get a foot in and intercept. Trying to get the ball in behind. That was a chance, really, of getting into a scoring position then, but anything but. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. So, a good piece of defending with the interception. Maybe to set up a counter-attack. Now Atsu, to Maxima. He's gone in to get it, and boy did he get it. Another turnover in play here with that interception. And Newcastle on the attack. Steven Bergwijn. Now Atsu. Taking on a couple of opponents now. Put into the middle. The keeper stops it. There could be a follow-up now. That's a great interception. It has to be... Very quick. Still can't believe another head, you know, after that shot. And what a save it was from the keeper. Tottenham supporters know they got off the hook there. And Tottenham get it back again. The hosts have controlled possession here so far. But I don't think the manager will be happy down there watching this performance. He would have been expecting more. The fans would, and I was. You have to feel that they will step it up sooner or later. Lucas. Well, poor pass, good interception. Take your choice. Well, for a club, the... Guiding it through the defenders. He fancies his chances of getting past these players. The chance is here. He has come to the rescue this time. Break quickly when they get possession. Kane. Sizoka. 
Joe Linton. And that's uh, Maxima. Son. Lucas. And in time coming up, there will be two minutes of it. And that's uh, Maxima. And maybe the counter attack is on here. So it's half time and we're still waiting for that first goal. So it is time now for the start of the second half. Now Tongi Dombele. Toby Alderweireld. Sanchez. Now Kane. Got past his marker. Working the... Must take the lead here. The goalkeeper will get this one, no problem. Miguel Almiron. Well, that'll be a throw. Alas, San Maximo. They want to use the width, Newcastle. And they're doing it well now. Can he pick somebody up? Oh, that's a fantastic goal! Well, this is the stickiest of sticky situations, isn't it? Because defeat today, and they've given the title to their deadly rivals, and they're losing. Yeah, it seems to be all slipping away from them. They've really got to try and reverse the trend here and get themselves back into this match. Well, he took a risk there, sliding in with that challenge in the penalty area. John Joe Shelby. Probing with the pass. There was a chance, really, of getting into a scoring position then, but anything but. Blocked off the pass there. Aurie. This could be an opportunity in behind the defence. Not tip-top Tottenham at the moment. They're trailing, and really they should be level. Well, the fans urging much better from the team. Guiding the pass through. Behind the defenders and onside. They've got in to score here. It's offside. That's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the striker seemed to time his run really well. Sizoko. Lucas. Sizoko. Bergwijn made sure the ball is stuck at his foot. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Good, clean tackle. Look at the skill there, Alan. Well, that is the type of skill that can win football matches. And the forward could be played in. It was a lovely pass. It's offside. That's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the striker seemed to time his run really well. Looking to work the width of the pitch, Tottenham, at the moment. Could be a quick break here for Newcastle. Frustrating for them, really. That was the opportunity to play on the break, but it's broken down. Well, they're getting the ball forward, they need to do that. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Slipping it through. Trying to run off the shoulder of the last player, offside. That is a weakness in his game. Gets caught offside too many times. Well, I wondered about the change, Alan. You'd think they might have brought on a more defensive player just to shore up the situation now they're leading, but they want more goals, it seems. Yeah, I suppose the school of thought is that he doesn't want to just sit on the lead and invite pressure. He wants to... Well, that's what they've been looking for. The ball in behind. That is a supreme save at full stretch. Up for grabs here. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? Lucas. Bergwijn.
still on the lookout for that chance to open up the opposition. How to find a goal in a time of need? That's the question for this team here. The consequences are almost unthinkable because the title will go to the opposition if they don't score. Yeah, and they haven't looked themselves so far at least. Not much time to rectify that. Well, plenty of speed, but not much organisation. And the ball lost at a crucial time. Still seven minutes left on the clock. Now Sessegnon. Now Kane. And it's with Newcastle again. And they're going to have to restart with a throw. The Spurs fans can be very demanding. They are demanding an equaliser here. Well, I'm not sure we're going to see it. And I don't think the players believe either, Martin. Nabil Bentaleb. was clipped in over the top. And there's the cutback. But got his angles wrong with the pass. Well, the Spurs fans rise as one. Not much time left now. The referee has indicated there will be a minimum. Great challenge by a player team. who's been doing that all game. But we're down to the last minute here. Lucas. Kane! Well, the game has run its course here, and there's the final whistle.